And we're live. Welcome to Bet Records, where we talk about hot topics, ideas, and all the shit you really want to hear. And we're live. I think we're on week 14 now, is that correct? Uh, <laughs> week 14, something like that. I don't know. All I know is Jonathan Taylor is on by uh, alert the uh, Chinese or something like that. Everyone. Um, let Russians. everybody know that Jonathan Taylor is on by. If you have him, you do, are do now. He's on by. You now no longer have an insta win in your fantasy draft well, matchup. Going against Ricky, so uh, yeah. Yeah, that's you get a bye week in, in yourself. You're, <laughs> yeah, uh, you get a bye week in your computer. Yeah. Um so yeah. Uh Jonathan Taylor out. Uh thank God I got Tony Pollard, dude. I mean pff, fuck, he's that guy that kid's a beast, dude. He had one good run last week. Dude, he got me fifteen points. He, he didn't get points. He had one rushing touchdown for that's like sixty yards. That's all you need, baby. Hey, I am lucky with Dalvin Cook, though. D. Cook, yeah. I got, I got his oh, backup. I got his backup. He keeps looking around the fucking <laughs> the thing. Put so, it if, lower, yeah, put it lower, dude. There you go. I'm not the one adjusting this thing. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good point. <laughs> there you go. That should work fine. Um, <laughs> so, uh, yeah, anybody, uh, any strong fantasy picks this week? What do you guys got? So, I think Christian McCaffrey is a strong play this week. I mean, the dude's been tearing up all season. You've been saying that <laughs> since you had him, since the draft. Uh, and uh, Nah, go. he's got a season-long injury. Uh, I got Jeez. the, the I best guy in fantasy football, Nick Folk. He's on bias. Antonio week, so. Brown is some bullshit. Yeah, what's going on with that, Keegan? Can I swear? Yes, Keegan. <laughs> yes, <laughs> <Yeah. can. laughs> I just want to make sure. Antonio Brown... You can say whatever the fuck you want, bitch. All right, Antonio Brown is some bullshit. Do you know why he's suspended? What happened? Do you know why he's suspended? Because oh, I know faked why. his Vax card. Yeah, his yeah vax card. that's some bullshit, okay? <laughs> that Vax whole deal is is bullshit in my eyes. But... Hey, I'm not complaining. I got Godwin, you know? He's yeah, gonna, you're he's gonna, not complaining because you got gonna his backup. He's going to rip it up. But you know who doesn't have his backup? The guy that has Antonio Brown. <laughs> 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 That's oh, some bullshit. God. Do you have Gronk, though, on your team? I, I do have Gronk. Gronk Gronk's been doing some yeah. work. So are you, uh, are you getting a little scared going into these uh, last couple weeks of play? No, because playoffs? I have a lot of bye weeks. I'm playing a lot of guys that aren't playing. Uh, for example. Uh, for example, taking the dub. A.K. Ricky. Yeah. A.K. Ricky. That's fair. He does have a phone now. Uh, yeah, he does have a phone, but he hasn't known his password in the last two years, so how much can you really take from that? <laughs> yeah, that's, that's Not true. much. I was going to say, we got two more weeks until the playoffs. Playoffs for us, I did set, I believe, you week right 16. Now? I am on it right now. I'm going to put mine up so um, I can use mine to help me my team out anyway so I can give information about my team. There you go. Yes, let <laughs> us know. We are now week 14. Week 15 has some tough matchups up here as well. Though, you do play I Let's Go Brandon. I am the second best team. <laughs> Let's, Let's, go Brandon. Brandon. Play Let's Go Brandon. Let's Go Brandon, 15, week 15. J.K. No, ain't even team. playing, okay? So that does it. That means I get taken the dub and let's go, Brandon. Speaking of which, let's go, Brandon. But anyways, <laughs> I got two bye weeks coming up. All right. So I'm, I'm either gonna dude, I'm be. Third now? I'm gonna at least fuck? be in fourth. Yeah, I just beat you. Actually, I don't know if I beat you. I shouldn't say you, that. You, uh, you did beat me. My team put up a, a shit thing, but I won this. I you crushed had, this if week. I remember right, I crushed Adam if I remember week. right, you had one player that fucked up. Uh, Swift got hurt in the first quarter. That's what yeah, it was. was That's what it was. Yeah. Honestly, if Swift didn't get hurt, it would have been close. It would have been close. I think you still would have won, but it would have been. I close. think it would have been. I honestly, I wouldn't be able to say that I would have been able to win. I can't take that into my own account, yeah. but I think it would have been close. Yeah. I think well, we would have been a Swift couple. got me like one point. That's how I felt when like I that. when Edmonds got hurt, bro. Yeah. When usually, Edmonds got hurt, he usually averages about ten points. That's about. Oh, so that's Swift puts me up being fifteen kind. to twenty, dude. I was gonna say that's me being kind. Ten points. <laughs> that's average. That, at the least, that's me being yeah. kind. That that I think it wasn't. I won't say. Uh, I think it was last week, maybe the week before, when he got hurt in the first fucking two minutes of the goddamn game, and I only got one point. I think I was playing you that fucking week. Probably. That week pissed me <laughs> off. Well, that's okay. I'll take third. Dude, let's move into I'm the matchup. I'm still in second, so I still don't want to hear shit. So the matchup you, of the week this week for our league, 
Waddle My Wood versus Swayze. Okay. Let's go, baby. Okay. Okay. Each team's Waddle projected my, 80 points. Waddle My Wood is in eighth fucking... We, he's in eighth he's place. He's not even making the playoffs. Nah, he ain't making shit. Whether he wins every game of the season, he still ain't making I shit. Think, I think I'm going to be Trent this week, honestly. I need to get a QB because <laughs> oh, my QBs too? are on high. Right. Yeah. Right. I'm, I'm on my... Q-tips league. He's in 11th. On... I don't care. I'm still on Q-tips <laughs> I'm only eight points behind Trent right now, and I just don't even have a QB right now. <laughs> I don't have a kicker in, but Why still. are you both... What? Dude, I have guys, no one left. How are you guys the only projected 88 points? I have nobody. Uh, Dude, I, I don't I have, have a, a kicker of, in it. I have I'm a lot of really good players injured right now. I have nobody left. The- Thielen is injured. Uh, Thomas is injured. The only person I still have left from when I drafted is Gibson and Kittle. So- oh, yeah. Your team's like the yeah. IR bug. I yeah. forgot about that. Yep. Hey, I was on that last year, and y'all made shit for me, so you can fuck off. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez, so aggressive. I think I'm about Fuck to do it, that. dude. They these people that are listening aren't around to the people that these were do last year. Y'all made fuck of me last year. <laughs> I came in last, y'all, so your team was fine. Half the team was gone for IR. So now you can fuck off, man. <laughs> That's fair. I fucked up. I fucked now up. the question for Trenton is, are you gonna keep Christian McCaffrey next year? No. no. I wouldn't. <laughs> I would okay. All right. That's all no. I need to know. I'm not, yeah. I'm honestly, he, he hasn't played the last two years. I'm honestly not really sure hasn't. about what I want to keep. You remember when I had year. Saquon? I wonder who I'm going to keep. Who no, I wonder who you're going to keep. Actually, who are you going to keep? I wonder. <laughs> no, Josh, actually, who are you going to keep? Najee Harris, huh? You're going to pass up on Najee for uh, JT? Jonathan Taylor, bro? I yeah. know you got to yeah. do it. Yeah. I know I was, you got to get If I was going to keep somebody, I probably would keep Fournette, I would think, out of my team. Who? Fournette. Tampa or... Bay running back, your favorite team. Fuck Tampa Bay. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, okay, okay. Tampa Bay... <laughs> Honestly, the NFL is rigged. I don't give a fuck about what anybody says. <laughs> you look into it, the shit's fucked up, man. Dude, literally, it's literally lining up to be a Tampa Bay, Tampa Bay versus Patriots Super Bowl this year. Didn't you see some? Yeah, and Tampa yeah. Bay is gonna win because this fucking they're gonna the, the other teams fucked. <laughs> yeah, they all 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 uh. Wait, how many teams are in the league again? <laughs> and thanks for our sports analysts for that uh, yeah. great insight. On yeah, what is the sports analyst? I mean, somebody jump in here. Wow. All right, well, that's our fantasy episode, I guess. Hey, hey, all that matters is I'm in second place of the league. Of the four people sitting in this room, I'm in second. So y'all can Suck it. Hey, hey, Keegan, uh, what, what do you have yeah, to say? Yeah, what's up, eighth place? What do you, what do you have to, what, <laughs> what do you have to say to Cole? Um, the past couple weeks, you know. Mr. Uh, Sussnut, don't he, call him Cole. You might as well call him by a certain name. Yeah, he did win last week, but, uh, he's been, he's been kind of dropping. He's been hey, hovering he in won, that He might have won last week, but what, what, what place is he in in the league? Fourth. Is he gonna be? He's in the playoffs, yeah. I know yeah. he is. Oh boy. So far, but we got two more weeks. Who's in first? Ah, uh, that's a good question. Herfie is still oh, wow. is right. the, the quiet contender. Uh, so Herfie and Keegan are tied nine and four for the top of our league, first and second place. Don't I play Herfie this week? Uh, third oh, and do. fourth. In fifth, they're all tied with eight and five. That is Josh, Josh in third place. <laughs> oh no, I play Wyatt. That's an easy dub. That nah, should be. An easy uh, I got JT on by. To be fair, I'm playing oh, this yeah, week. To right. make the week interesting, which this may or And may Swift is still hurt. Fuck! Hey, this Put him on IR. Pick someone else. This may or may he's not, not... He's not, not IR. No, he's, he's, he's questionable. That's fucking This great. may or not, may not hurt me. I'm playing this week with an injured player because I don't want to drop a player. You don't want to drop that anyone? But you have a sub I really for don't. Player, don't. Do you have you? two defenses or kickers <clears throat> on your team? To what? Kickers or defense? I, that doesn't change my my stance. Wouldn't you just drop <laughs> somebody though? Why wouldn't you no, drop? No, I got I got a wide uh, wide receiver that's out, and I don't want to mm. drop him to pick I'm... up another player because he's a decent wide receiver. He's just he's quite. I should say he's questionable. Which you know how fantasy works, man. Yeah, Sometimes they're questionable. You, yeah. you, really, you really never know. Sometimes there's a sneaky fucking. It's like a sneaky link. Sometimes they show up, sometimes <laughs> they don't. 
You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So sometimes, fuck, for all we know, they show up at the last day and they fucking play their hearts out and they get fucking 20 points. You can never really judge. I've been playing fucking at you all season. Yep. 90% of the Actually, I shouldn't even say 90% of the season. Half the season, he played like shit the first half of the season. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the other half of the season, though, he's been putting Tearing up his up. numbers. Yep. He's been putting up his numbers. So it's like he can't drop... You know what I mean? You can't you can't lose hope on certain players. No. You gotta look at what they do, and you gotta look at how they respect their team. Because honestly, Ayuk should have been dropped. I didn't drop him. I had faith in him. He put up his numbers though at the end of the season. Special, yeah, respectful. and he's a special situation as well because he's the number two wide receiver still for that football team. Um, whereas I'm just looking at your team. Honestly, I, you know, I know, I know Mikola Hardman. Yeah, you can throw him in there, but I mean, he does, he does nothing. Hardman, dude. I don't have Hardman. Do hey, I? yes, you got him on your bench, dude. Okay, well, the key word there is on my bench. <coughs> yeah, drop him. Why are you talking about people on my bench? Why don't you talk about people on my starting lineup? <laughs> well, d- drop. That's what I'm saying. Okay, you can well, drop well, him. Well, that sounds like somebody's trying to get some players on. No, nah, I don't want him, bro. He- okay, <laughs> so then why are you bringing up people on my bench? Because why would you? Because you, you said put- that you don't want to drop anyone. All right, yeah. so then why are you bringing up people on my bench why if you don't you want the people on, on my bench? Well, then don't drop if anyone. If you're bringing up, okay, if the eighth place person is bringing up the people on my bench. <laughs> and I'm and I'm tired. Oh, I still first. wouldn't pick that dude up. He doesn't. He's right, the so fourth why, wide receiver so on the team. So why are you bringing up the people on my bench, bro? Why would I pick up the fourth wide receiver <laughs> on the Kansas City the, Chiefs who okay, can't even give okay. it to their first it, two yeah, options? I'm not to begin saying. With. I don't know the reasoning. But if the person that's in eighth place in our 12, how did uh, league, hey how did Tyreek Hill do for you this week? Oh, uh, he fucked up. Yeah, <laughs> that's why I don't want the fourth option in that hey, offense either. You know, you know what's funny? <laughs> he's the number one. You option. You know what's funny still? You're bringing up the person that's on my bench. Why don't you bring up the people on my starting lineup? Because <laughs> you said you didn't want to drop anyone. There's I don't. To drop. I don't. Because you know what? In there. One bad week does not qualify for an entire season. Yeah, but if he hasn't scored double-digit points for in uh, two 13 weeks, weeks Michael Hardman, 13, 13 should we weeks. Should pull up his stats? Because, frankly, I don't know his stats. Because <laughs> that's how long he's been sitting on my bench. <laughs> so there you go. You could drop him. Drop them is drop them. Uh, I still ain't giving them to the people below me. Well, because yeah. with my past luck, five weeks, he hasn't with, scored five points. Okay, with my luck, I'll just. That's why he's sitting on my bench. Drop him. <laughs> if I drop him and you pick him up, I'm going to hit you in the nuts. Hey, if I, <laughs> hey, if I, hey, hey, Keegan, if you drop him and I pick him up, I'll give you $100. Shake. No, because you won't pick him up just to keep that $100. And you exactly. know, you but know, that, I need that. You're worried about him picking him up. <laughs> no, because Trenton will pick the Trenton will make that bet, and as soon as that week's up, he'll pick him up just to <laughs> fuck me over. Up <laughs> no, I won't pick him up this whole season. Fuck that, dude. Yeah, we only have two weeks of the season left. Well, the people who aren't in the playoffs anyway. Yeah, I only got two people weeks left. People ain't in the playoffs. I'm the only motherfucker in the playoffs that are sitting. Actually, Josh is in the playoffs. <laughs> yeah. I'm in, yeah I'm in, but but I'm in but, third, so. <laughs> Every twi- I played you twice, and I'm pretty sure I beat you the two times. I it's played impossible you. for you to play me twice already. Is it? I guess I honestly I wouldn't know. Well, that. actually, I guess it's not no, impossible. It's not impossible. Pretty, it's very thought, unlikely. Very unlikely. It would be the I, I only thought, team to hit twice because there's 12 teams. Josh, Josh, I could be wrong, but I'm. I thought I played you twice. I don't know. How I could it works. be wrong. I could be wrong. That wouldn't be possible. I I, no. I could be wrong. No, Thirteen weeks possible. of football. Well, it would be very. Oh yeah, it would be possible. Twelve I, teams. Like, Josh, yeah. if you're looking at it play. now, I would. Yeah. Did you play Week twice? one, we Damn. played. Oh shit! Did I win? Yeah, your team went out. Oh, dude, Mike. That's when Mike Kaseki put up a goose egg. Hey, for fuck me. Mike Kaseki. I dropped him the next day, and I picked up Schultz, and Schultz has been putting up ten okay. points a week. Now. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Did I play you twice or no? Yes, you did say yeah, that. Yeah, you did. Did I beat you twice or did I beat you once? <laughs> Fool me once? Shame on you. That's okay. You know what's funny, though? Is if you... <laughs> See? That's okay. You if can't you... talk shit to the second... If you hey, know I'm funny, above though, you. If, I'm above if you, you lose these next two weeks and oh, I fuck. win the next I'm two fuck. weeks, I'm it doesn't fuck. matter that you beat me twice. I, I still beat you. That's I don't true. give a That's fuck. True. No. And you'd be out of the playoffs if I, you lost If you're 0-2, but you just so happen to be a certain team... Do you really win? Yeah, yeah, I beat the team. Does, it, half does of the regular season hey, matter? Or does hey, the playoffs hey, hey, let's matter? Let's just listen. 
Half of this guy's team was out when I played him, so I beat him. You know him. Green Bay lost the first game of the season. Now they're one of the Why best teams Green in the Bay NFC. Why would Green Bay matter? Because I don't have Green Bay and neither do you. <laughs> oh if we're talking fantasy, why are you bringing up teams that neither of us have drafted? What? I might have somebody from Green Bay. Hold on. I, 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 I want to make that keyword mm-hmm. might. I might have people from mm-hmm. Green Bay. See how he's on his phone right now trying let's, to figure out. Look I'm looking at him. I'm, I'm looking at him. Green Bay. This oh, motherfucker's I saying I might, <laughs> I might have people on Green Bay. Let me look right quick. I had a lot of Dallas players. Okay, yeah, like, honestly, I, I think of, Dallas should be doing better than they, they should, are. dude. I don't they, know what's they going have on with good, those guys. They have I good players. Pl- okay, players. I'm not a big Dallas fan. I'm not either. But I think that the, t- the players that they have, they should be doing a lot better. I think, well, I shouldn't even really necessarily say a lot better, but they should be doing better. Yeah. I don't know if that's just me. but no, I, I definitely think, agree. They have the talent. They just they can't have put it the together. Talent. It's like the Vikings. We have talent, but we don't know how to do chemistry. It's, the, it's a chemistry aspect. You can't just say, like, we have good players and we're going to do good. You got to have a team chemistry in that team aspect. You know so would saying? you would you say like Dallas is like Viking soulmates almost like as they're as where they're at in the season? Honestly, as much or like the, the, ugly this, twin this, sisters this, or something. This, I was gonna say this might have a lot of dispute against it, but I think the Vikings and Dallas are very similar. Mm-hmm. We have good players. Dallas has good players. We have good players, but at the end of the day. It comes down to that team chemistry. If you don't have team chemistry and you don't know how to play with one another, it's it's like a friendship, you know? If you don't have a good chemistry with that friend, you can't make certain jokes, you know? That's fair. You can't you can't like like with me and my friends, as all of you know, I like to make very inappropriate jokes. I like to make fun of you guys. <laughs> but if we didn't have the chemistry for me to make fun of you, it wouldn't work. True. Now, true. I could have the most in-line jokes possible, but if we don't have the chemistry for those jokes to land, they're not going to land. If I'm going to make that joke for that quarterback to throw that pass, it ain't going to land because oh. we don't have the chemistry for that pass to land. Does that make sense? That makes perfect sense. It does make sense. I see you guys looking at me like, what the fuck? But does that not make make sense? sense. It does make sense. That chemistry is is almost, it's almost, you can't have a good team without chemistry. Now, that's one thing I I, I very like the Minnesota teams on is they are constantly trying to build that chemistry, whether it's the Timberwolves or the Vikings or the Wild even. They try to make that chemistry, but having a chemistry off the court or off the ice or off the field is different than the chemistry on the court Mm -hmm. or on the field. 100%. That's what's fucking them up. And and I'm not one to say Mike Mike Zimmer, he's fucking up the the Vikings. You think that's what it is? I think we need a new... I think we need a whole new offensive line coach... A defensive coach. I think we need a whole new coaching staff. A whole new staff. I think our staff is fucked up. You know what I think would be a great solution? Is if Minnesota just left and went somewhere else and we got, like, the Rams or something. I don't know. Do you know what happened? We could make it work. Do, like, a trade for a trade and lose some draft picks Do you know what happened last time that happened? What, with the North Stars? No, we were the Minneapolis Lakers. That's we true. were the Lakers at that one point. That is true, yes. <laughs> we were the Lakers. You know what happened as soon as we lost the Lakers? They went to L.A. and they're... they're and they're, how many championships did they win Did they win with a new coach? Oh, I'm sure. Yeah. We, won, new, yeah. we won about eight championships with a different coach. People say they don't want to blame it on our coach, and I can't blame them because as an as a athlete growing up, your coach is your fucking heart. You know what I'm saying? Josh, I know you played sports growing up. Mm. You would never turn your mindset different than your coach. Your coach was right. Whether you agreed with him or not, at the end of the day... <laughs> at the end of the day... At the end of the day, though, the whether you liked your coach or not, 
if your coach called the play or called something, you followed it because you trusted your coach. Fair. How is to say the Vikings aren't doing the same? Now here is a real question, Josh. We already talked about the chemistry for both of these teams. Thursday night football, Dallas at Minnesota. Which team will show up with the best chemistry? Dallas. Yeah, I got the Vikes pulling it out, actually. Do you think really? so? I think they're going to make a really? run at that wild card spot. Hey, we should watch that nuts. game together. On Thursday? Yeah. They're going to be here Thursday. All I need, uh, dude, I don't, I don't do nothing but sit at home while uh, fucking yeah. win. All I need to know is no dates and times, and I'm there. Y'all just don't tell me the dates right, and times. So on Thursday, show up to Q-Tip's house. At, at like 6 a.m. 6 a.m. Uh, just snuggle up in bed with him and uh, we'll come <laughs> find you. He doesn't let me snuggle up in bed with him, so I can't do that. <laughs> Josh, Josh, Q-tip. Josh, I know where you live now. <laughs> oh my god. That's all good. I got locks and, <laughs> and a garage door. Locks are only as good as the nine mil. I got oh, plenty of those. Uh, I know you do, but so do I. I can get into your house. <laughs> yeah, I got uh, nine million too. <laughs> Trent, oh, shut God. up. You don't even know the difference between a nine mil and a, and a fucking twenty two. Whoa! Why are you calling? I am twenty two. Jesus Christ! Well. I guess that's our sports talk. That's it we got for football. Hopefully uh, the Vikings pull this one out. They will need it for... <laughs> they're not getting on the wild card. We're lost so. hey, cause. Hey, 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 We'll make it to the first round of the playoffs. After that, we won't make it. Five bucks, we don't make it to the wild card. If, for those Shake that, it, bake so, it. I was going to say, for those that can't see, I'm shaking his hand. We'll make it to the first round. After the first round, we'll lose. He's saying we won't even make it to the first round. Nope. I want this to be known between Josh and Q-Tip that are watching this handshake. And the thousands of viewers at home, make sure to subscribe on YouTube. Hit that red button down there. Hit the bell on Spotify as well. I'm saying crack a beer with me. And then we'll see you on the next one. I like how she move it. I like how she move it. I got that new whip. Go get a dude trip. I like how she move it. I like how she move it.